Really, really nice guy, really friendly to a lot of people, and you know, a really, really good role model to a lot of these guys trying to get in the Comp Madden scene and make content creation. So I wanted to ask you first things first, how did you get into Madden? Like, what was your introduction? And it could have maybe been a different video game or just something like that. How did you get into Madden, you know, just kind of playing it? And how was your childhood, like, growing up, pretty much? Uh, yeah, so um, uh, oftentimes growing up, we always watch the Raider game. And, you know, I'm a big sports fanatic. My whole family is. We watch all the sports. Um, we're local, so that means basically we root for all the semi-local teams. So for me, it was Oakland Raiders. Now it's Las Vegas Raiders. Obviously, yep. I still support them. So, you know, they're, that was one of my favorite teams, the Oakland A's, another one of my favorite teams. And then the Golden State Warriors is my other favorite team. So, you know, watching a lot of sports growing up, you know, obviously you're going to play some sports as well. So, you know, I played a lot of basketball. Um, I was way too skinny, way too small to play football. So, you know, I did play a lot of basketball. Plus, you know, it was my parents didn't really want me playing football because it is, it is a little dangerous, especially if yeah. you know, you're on the shorter side, smaller side. So, you know, I just was playing basketball a lot growing up, um, you know, watching all the NBA games, NFL games, MLB games. And, you know, um, going into middle school, high school, you know, I, I really was all right at basketball, but, you know, I didn't really have the confidence or, you know, the uh, encouragement to actually go and try out. I was, you know, a little scared that I wasn't going to make it, you know, and uh, all that type of stuff. But I was competitive, man. But, you know, I was still a little nervous. And, you know, obviously growing up in high school and middle school, we all uh, struggle with some, some of those type of things. So, you know, that was yeah. that for me. And, you know, I was bummed out. You know, I, I don't know. I just had little confidence in that aspect, but, you know, I, I turned it into, you know, uh, Madden Mobile, and, you know, I played that a lot in high school, middle, uh, yeah, in high school, that's when it came out, and then from there, you know, I kind of gained some notoriety from that, and, you know, I kind of got my school hooked on a Madden Mobile, so, um, okay. from there, you know, everyone was playing Madden Mobile during the classes, during, you know, lunch, during recess, break, whatever it may be, and, you know, I, that was cool, man. I, I had fun with it. But, you know, when a lot of people were on my on that type of trend, on that type of wave, I kind of like, you know what, man? I kind of want to switch this around, man. I want to go into console now because a lot of people already, you know, doing this, doing that. It kind of got tiring of doing the same old, same old. So, you know, I got into um, Madden on the console. And, you know, not literally no one was doing that, at least in my high school at the time. So, you know, I was often spending a lot of time just uh, chilling alone in the PS4 parties, uh, whether, you know, just be playing or just watching other people play. And that's where I kind of got into watching Twitch and YouTube, man. So, obviously, I always had that competitive fire. So, I kind of wanted to, you know, be better at the game because, obviously, we all boot up Madden. We're going to get, you know, murked. We're going to get beat bad whenever <laughs> yeah. we first start up. Yeah. So, uh, I wanted to get better. I hated losing. I, I always hated losing. So... From there, you know, I looked up why YouTube money plays, YouTube blitzes, and then you know, from there, I'm like, hold up, bro. There's this thing called Twitch where you could do live streaming, and you know, that's you know, obviously YouTube is great and all, but you know, it was kind of a little outdated. The stuff I was looking at, you know, for example, a video I'd watch would be like already came out a month ago, and then I would constantly be searching for you know that day content, like you know, whenever I was on YouTube, I was trying to find the daily stuff that came out, the, the content, the blitzes, the, the, you know, crazy games. And, you know, I'm like, what a better way to do that than li Twitch live streaming service. So this was around Madden 15. Um, and this was obviously just a hobby at the time. I had a PS4. And like I said, I was literally the only one in my friends group that, uh, at least in, in real life friends group, that played Madden. I got a couple of people to join up, but they really didn't commit too much time compared to me onto it. And then from there, you know, I had to look out and find some online friends. And then we all know how that story goes. I got into Twitch, watching it quite a bit. And, you know, there's some other people in the chat. I talk to them a lot. And, you know, we'd wager for coins. We play. Yep, I remember uh, those. <laughs> yeah. I've, we really the four, the big focal points of, you know, playing Madden is just, you know. Now, now quick question. Sorry Go to ahead. cut you off. Yeah, um, no, no, you're problem, fine. But I wanted to actually ask you, who is your first Twitch streamer you watch Madden-wise? Who you're like, like, you would watch a lot of and you really um, like their content. So when I say it was like Madden 15 or 16, I do remember watching like T-Raw and yep, Problem yeah. playing a lot. They would play quite a bit. Not each other, and um, but just they would play and stream a lot. And this was around, I think Problem used to be on PS4 at this time. And yep. like he'd go on crazy game win streaks and butt head to head and head to head and 
you know, as a casual viewer, that's the things I like to see. And I remember T. Rob would often play like so many money coin games, money games, and you know, he was actually really, really good. He had some nice glitchy offenses and glitchy. I remember blitzes. back in the day, bro, when he again sorry to cut you off, but um, he would um. So when NCAA football was a thing, and I was like, I was in middle school. Um, I remember playing the. There were YouTubers. Uh, I don't know if you know who these guys are, Poppin, but these guys are like some of the OG guys in Madden, like Addy Cards, Mr. Yeah. Golden. Th- you know, what I mean? Mr. Yeah. Golden Thumbs is you know obviously Golden Sports now. And yeah. Obviously, God's Thumbs, all that stuff. And I remember I used to be in parties sometimes with them. It's just because I was like kind of like a little. I was like not a little kid, but I was in middle school, like going to high school. I was like a fan. I was like, oh my gosh, yeah, like, these guys boy. are YouTubers. Yeah. You know, um, Moss to Chappie was another guy. Yeah, I, I do remember, remember him. Pl- I remember playing, like, uh, God's Thumbs one time. I, like, just hit him up randomly. And, like, this is, like, when I was younger. So I invited him to a party. I'm like, this guy's not going to come. And he, like, actually joined that party. Wow. And I think it's because I was on it, like, 6 a.m. And I guess, like, he was, like, the only one who, like, because he's in the military. So he's used to getting up wow. early. So he'd be like, what's okay. up, man? I'm like, yo, dude, I-, I love your channel. I've been in parties with you and Addy. Like, can we get a game in? He's like, sure. And he beat the hell out of me, man. I wow. thought I was good. He just destroyed me beat me like probably scored close to 90 points and i maybe mm-hmm. had a field goal it was bad wow it yeah bad. and uh, <laughs> honestly that's like i feel like uh everyone is so known nowadays though that's the thing that's great for all of us but you know that do i know what you're talking about like you, you think you're good you're like oh yeah man i'm feeling good i'm feeling good yep. and like these guys would stream but like you still like even if they streamed you still wouldn't fully grasp what was going on and how good mm-hmm. they were Compared to now, I feel like, you know, everyone knows actually how good each other is, uh, you know, how each other, how good everyone is compared to, like, you know, even if they don't play them. But, you know, I definitely know what that aspect you're talking about is, like, that unknown kind of like, oh, wow, you know, he's good, but I didn't think he was this good. I know what you're talking about. I know that feeling. Yeah, and I, it, it was the best feeling ever because, like, even though I got my ass kicked, I'm like, wow, like, this is so cool. Like, I thought he would just, like, in his videos, he just does this, this, and that. And yeah, I it's so I could simple beat to dance. And yeah. he countered it. <laughs> yeah, hundred yeah. percent, man.